Ladies and gentlemen, I want to welcome you back to Mass Infected Andromeda. I am Schaffner the Destroyer. And, and this I'm Princess. Is Princess. We are... I could, should have probably waited, but oh well. So far, we've uh, met new aliens. There. Beefy Koreans. Beefy Koreans. They do look like beefy Koreans. From the body shape, people, not the face. I don't know what the crap a Korean looks like, except for one picture of Tally. Yeah. Which looked more humanoid than I was expecting, but whatever. Closely. Do not try to explore hey. the city or interact with anyone. Well, I tell Ephra's Patrick. gods will use force if necessary. No, it was no. just a problem Understood. with it loading in. Is it okay to where it was. Oh, animation issues. Yeah. I suppose. I remember hearing about that. If you're the yeah, god, they are beefy Koreans. He's yeah. leader of the resistance. What's that? They fight the cat and protect us. Is it a different, different race? They're different from the stuff we've encountered so far. I mean, no, like the leader of the resistance. Oh, no. Everything here. Oh, I figured it was like an intergalactic. No, the only aliens they have encountered is the cat until oh, okay. us. Am I that intimidating? You're an outsider who invaded our home. We know nothing about you. I'm not here to cause trouble. Then keep moving. I, I'm, I'm moving. I can try to jump, but it won't let me. Nope, you came out there naked. Not even a rocket launcher. Because <laughs> you're a brave man. None of the local flora register in my data files. We've no shit. An ecosystem. <coughs> Your city is beautiful. Thank you. You're the first outsider to see it. I'm honored. What happens if Afro doesn't like me? He won't. But you need to earn his trust. He's responsible for everyone's safety. I know what that's like. You're a leader. Trying to be. This is the Resistance Headquarters. Ephra is waiting inside. They are bullies, but this situation is now your fault. Don't get kicked out, Moran, not because of them. But you're telling me to be weak? No. I'm telling you to be strong through your cunning and heart. Okay? Hey. It really is the best nice one in resistance. Gun. I know. Our experience with the cat makes us naturally distrustful of all aliens. We've had our own run-ins with the cat. Then, you really do understand. When the Archon came to Helios, he demolished our sovereign state. Took what he wanted, as if we were nothing. Now, the Ket mercilessly abduct Angara. Often, we never see our people again. Come this way. Ephra is waiting. Wait, the Ket oh, kidnapped the you and steal your people? And the Resistance fights them every day with everything we can. Is it attrition? What are they after? You should save your questions for Ephra. Kadara be damned. I won't lose Vold. Ephra, this is one of the aliens from the Milky Way. A Pathfinder. Milky Way. Pathfinder. It's an aggressive move coming to Aya. It wasn't meant that way. I have an ark full of desperate people counting on me to find them a home before they starve. Of course, I feel for you and your people. So, Pathfinder, never mind how you even found us. Why are you here? On a hostile planet we call Eos, I explored an ancient structure, a vault, and brought it back online. It stabilized that planet's environment. Remnant. Recent intelligence supports that claim. If I'm right, 
There's a vault on Aya that's different. <coughs> I need to look inside. You're right. There's a vault out there, but it was shut years ago and the entrance hidden. We can't help you. The Moshai could. She's our most revered scientist and elder. She knows this vault. But now the Ket have her, and our rescue attempts failed. She's lost to us, and you. There must be another way. How can I convince you? Can I offer help? Arrogant. I don't know you, let alone trust you. Why would I want your help? Of course. Ephra, I feel... Ephra, what this alien says is extraordinary. The Moshai would want us to be brave and not let this chance pass. Joel, you talk too much. Let me assess this alien. I'll be cool. your eyes. I know you can spare me. Go if you want. But when he tries to kill you, be prepared to strike first. Cool. I'm Jal Amaderov. I'll be your envoy through Angaran space. Aww. Thank you for trusting me. I don't. But I can always kill you in your sleep. Good to know. See, I really like our crew. I like the Andara. I do too. They're neat. They are. I've organized my analysis of Aya. Shall I relay it to the Nexus? Definitely. Trade? Trade. Trade. <laughs> are you asking or telling? I'm wondering. Do you exchange goods and services? How does your economy work? We pay for things with a currency called credits, abstract wealth. The cat offered gifts, made odd bargains, never traded. What are your credits worth? What can we do with them? You pay them to us for whatever we're selling. Now we cut open the heart. And what do you offer? I don't know. What do you want? Your ship. Not for sale. <laughs> Worth a try. <laughs> Is there something else for you? Yes. Call me Soka. I run cargo between Aya and other worlds. Good work. Good at it. You're here to help my people. Prove it. I need help. One of my suppliers <coughs> off world stopped checking in. Has things I need. There could be trouble. What makes you think I can help? You found Aya, maybe you find my supplier. Can't hurt to ask. We might have different definitions of trouble. What do you mean? Natural hazards, wild predators, misadventure, what do you mean? Same thing. What's your supplier carrying exactly? Supplies I need, exactly. Things to keep my people alive. Essentials. You have a ship? I have my supplier's nav point. His name is Kelvo. Find him, his supplies. Come back and prove you're helpful. Then maybe we trade. All right, that's an interesting request. That's a weird request for somebody he just met. Be careful out there. Oh yeah. No, I will. You really think the Moshe is alive? Am I sure? Don't kill yourself bringing her home. No promises. I am Enro Bosan, assistant to Governor <coughs> Ramshai. You're free to explore this area. But the city is off limits. Until that changes, I'll be your liaison. How may I help you, Pathfinder? You don't just stand here waiting to answer my questions, right? I assist the governor in all matters. While you're here, this is my priority. Pretty far outside your normal job, huh? I did not begin this day expecting to speak with it. You? <laughs> nice save. Yeah, it's been a long day. Sounded like you and Jal know each other. Our families are related. You sound nothing alike. We have multiple worlds. Our culture is complex. I'd like oh. to know more. Earn our trust and maybe you will. 
Intergalactic. When am I allowed to visit the city again? Best not for me to decide. Who will? Your boss? Or Ephra? Governor Shai has jurisdiction over Aya. She will authorize your entrance if you earn Ephra's trust. You talk to Soka. I'm told our museum curator, Avela, wants to meet you. The Ket swayed us with words. Now we judge outsiders by their actions. What can you tell me about your other worlds? Life on them is hard, the people harder. Every day is a struggle to survive. Why not bring everyone here? We will not abandon any more worlds to <coughs> the Ket. And Aya cannot support all of us. Thanks for Fair your time, enough. Monroe. Of course. The cat took everything. Are they from another galaxy? The cat? Stars I don't know. above! It's you! I was hoping to get a chance to speak with you. You left your home to cross dark space. Is it true you can never go back? Yeah. This is home now. To take such a risk and give up your old life. Why did you do it? It sucks to wake up and be a new Palumpa the next day. For the chance to meet someone like you. Looks like it already paid off. Are all humans as quick with words? You'll have to find out. I suppose I will. My turn for a question. Do I get to know your name? Oh, of course. I'm Avela Kajar, curator for the Repository of History. We study relics of our past, try to piece together what we lost in the Scourge. And the truth is, there was something I wanted to talk to you about. Pathfinder, how much do you know about our history? Little than none. The cat hit your people pretty hard, right? They did. But long before that, the Scourge destroyed our technology, first targeting our ships. Many of those ships went down over Havaral. The wilds of that planet are filled with history. A scientist on Havaral just contacted me with a new nav point of an intact crash site. A huge opportunity. But with Remnant patrolling the area, we can't get close enough. Not like you can. How do you know about me and the Remnant? I have friends in the Resistance. They heard your conversation with Ephra. I know it's a lot to ask, but you have a ship and the means to get past the Remnant. Without your help, I'm stuck. You're trusting your history with an outsider? I know what people say about you, but I don't agree. I think you're here to help. I am. Now's your chance to prove it. You want to earn Aya's respect, right? Recovering our past will go a long way. I've always wanted to give archaeology a try. Oh, I was hoping you'd say that. If you find anything, I'll be here. Thank you, Pathfinder. That one's neat. Rider, ship's fixed up and ready to fly. Your but the uh, save my supplier. <laughs> we have kind of random. Like it. Where do you see the inside? <laughs> it gets better. Oh yeah. You ready to go? Love this sexy ship. I'll introduce you to the rest of my crew. Well, if you have a uh, st uh, lost supplier for your essential goods, you'll you'll grasp at any straws you want. Well, I mean, yeah, but I mean, why not? You know, one of our planets is under attack, or something I'm just saying as far as first something that makes the goes, cat actually that scary better than the last one <laughs> only slightly yeah what happened I wanted to look around and now we have another mouth to feed whatever he eats uh, I like him do the translators not work they work I know we're improvising as we go, but let's remember that there <coughs> is Pathfinder team protocol. Don't think I got that handbook. Ryder, we followed our best lead here, and now we don't even have that. Jal has offered to do what he can to help us access the vault on Aya. How do we do that when we're leaving the planet it's on? That's... a fair point. Jal? Seriously? Settle down. Ryder's right. There's an Angara right here. Let's hear from the new guy. One day, about 80 years ago, 
The Archon and the Ket arrived in Helios, and the horror began. They declared war? Nothing so easy to define or fight. The Ket kidnap Angara. Their people disappear without a trace. What if they were us? Sure, I'll fight Ket all day long, but that's no plan. I agree. We need to get into that vault rider. Surprisingly, I'm with PB. Our own mission has to take priority. No. We have a plan. Kind of. Pretty solid. Jal? The resistance is stretched thin. I was tasked with traveling to two of our worlds at our briefing this morning. And you'll accompany me. Because? Because then Ephra will see you as trustworthy. You want that. Jaws told me about these two worlds, Havarl and Vol. Before the Scourge disaster, Vold was a thriving planet of billions, a shining center of technology and life. And now? It's the center of our ground war against the Ket. Our resistance base is fighting Ket command for control of the planet. What about the other? That of sounds more like it. Is the birthplace of the Angara. It's started to degrade, to become wild and dangerous. We suspect Remnant. Now we're talking. We've recently lost contact with our scientists. Still don't get how any of this helps us. I do. Help us, or rather help me. And I'll vouch for you, right? Because Jal wants inside Aya's vault. I don't like her anymore. Pathfinder, it's your call. Don't know yet. Just be ready to go. Jaw and back to the victory. Got it? You bet. Jaw, give Callow the nav points for both planets. Let's do this. Yep. Jaw and Drac are winning on my favorites list. <laughs> that didn't take long for me to get for Jaw to like. One, his little eye thing is like twice as amazing as Garrus's was. Okay, the thing about the Ongarans hey, is their biology. Me, if you need anything. Uh, their biology works with technology. Like it, I don't know, but it's weird. And so their nerve synapses can fire with with some tech. Yes. That's amusing. Oh, I've already done all this. Let's move on then. Oh, I hate wearing headphones. God, it's digging into my I skull. So much biodiversity and the waterfalls, just like Sir Cash. Hmm. Huh. You don't want to think about Sir Cash right now. <laughs> you don't want to know what's going, what was going on around there about six hundred years ago. I'm picking up some. <coughs> of course you are. This is ridiculous. This is dumb. <laughs> Still don't like this. <laughs> it was neat the first time, but now it's. Uh, it's it, you should have known it was going to get old. Well, I knew the first time I did it, it was going to get old. Oh my god. Really, am I? All right. Oh, no, I'm not even going to give you that option. We're going to the ice world. We're saving the... We're saving the resistance. War is more important. I mean, what was going on the other one? The remnant problems? Remnant are very leave and let be. Cat are kind of douchey. That's the end of that story. Anomaly detected. Vold is the heart of our war against the Ket. I once took part yep. in an attack on one of their bases. Sounds, Sounds like fun. People. It was desperate. We won, but only barely. Wow. 
Okay, bundle up, people. I'll stay on my nice warm ship. <laughs> uh, it's nice having a Cerulean. All right. Let's do this. Are you thing. taking with you? Oh, oh, I almost forgot. Joel. Yes. Forget Liam. Liam is. Ugh. Liam's Liam is so caged and it's ridiculous. Yeah. And then Cora is more douchey than Ashley was in the first game. Yeah. Confirm. Right? Do I want other things? Ah, almost forgot. I didn't make it. Hmm. Your Bugman helmet is funny. It's a cat helmet. Bugman helmet. Confirm. Take her down. I am the Bugman! Oh my god, sexy ship. Original readings suggest that it had a breathable, nitrogen-rich atmosphere and oceans of H2O. Mm. I take this it that's this no one has a vault case. too. All H2O in Habitat Six, folds to the Angarai, is ice, and those oceans, frozen over <coughs> completely. Oh, there goes the dream of a seaside property. Um, apparently the atmosphere still works. So why is it frozen? It's a pretty intense blizzard. LZ is on the windward side of the mountain. Conditions are bad. I'm tracking gale force squalls. I love how it lands. Um, fly. Maybe not. Maybe we're, we're good. good. We're good. <laughs> you sure? <laughs> Want us to get out and push? <laughs> Very funny, Ryder. <clears throat> Cold hazard level one. Hold on. Fire up the nomad. What are you doing? I'm just looking at things. Fire up the nomad. Temperatures are below freezing and continuing to fall. I'm just going Supported. over here. Blizzard provides cover. Great for hidden base. Keep going, Ryder. Try not to make any sudden movements. You'll probably be watched. <laughs> no surprise. You think I got trained on me. As he books it across Straight everything. On. <laughs> need to talk to Commander Anyit when we arrive. <coughs> <coughs> well, that was dumb. Any squishies need to heat up? I like Drac. I do too. The, the, just the snark. God. Is 
Ooh, a goodie box. Yeah, that was a good one. Good to see you again, Commander Dozil. And you, Jal. This is the alien. The one you think can help yes. us. Yes. This is Ryder no. of the Andromeda Initiative. I am Anyik Dozil. Remember the name, because if you betray us, I will kill you myself. Be assured that what I do to you will make the stars turn their faces and grow dark. <coughs> I have no intention of betraying you. Say what you want. It is the hands that reveal true intention. If you wish to prove yourself, be an ally in our fight against the Ked. Despite our best efforts, their growing forces remain a threat to our people. Speak to our lookouts who watch the valley. Force just They'll know where our need is from. dire. Jarl, watch them. And be careful yourself, my friend. <clears throat> I always am. Yeah, if you don't look too hard at how the they move their faces, it's <coughs> the dialect isn't that bad. It's not dialect, the dialogue isn't that bad. Yeah, I can't use words. I always use the wrong one. Uh, shift change. Kit. Did they already meet the Andorra? And that's why we've got a good translation, or what? Uh, Sam trans translated as they were speaking. Than I expected, but they okay, started. apparently it's easier to translate. No, Sam was down. That's right with the cat. I remember. Yeah. That's the planet with everything on it. You don't win a war without an organization. From this room, we keep track of our brothers and sisters in the field. All right, we got a thing to do. We're going on an adventure to the Nomad. Temperatures are below freezing and continuing to fall. They know I'm not going to eat the bread. I bought the snacks last time. Let's try to make our first impression. Air packages from Ireland. Good to be back. You're so good at getting me. I have friends here. The ambient temperature is normal. Whoa, didn't mean to sneak up on you. Your commander said you could show us the valley. Zeke, I don't want to talk to it. You talk to it. Ryder Ooh. has a name. You named it? How do you even tell them apart? <laughs> just, <laughs> just, just, just stop talking. <laughs> now, we can show you the valley. What are you looking for? <laughs> I want to prove I'm here as an ally. That means oh god, that, that was wonderful. And you'll yeah. hit cat eventually. That was They're almost too close. And that's how you treat your best like friends, words, everybody. But with guns. We've had reports about captured Angara in a cat labor camp down in the valley. If you're here to help, like the commander says, you could start there. Anything else? Uh. What are those red lights down there? That's Hajara, just one of the Dar in the valley. There's people there that might need help, if you haven't checked it out already. How does anyone live out here? Why so surprised? We've adapted to this weather. Those lights are conspicuous. Wow. Don't the cat attack? We've adapted to that, too. The cat wants to take us alive, so we fight to the death. It seems to deter them. <laughs> What's that alien facility on that mountain over there? That's the cat command center. We have constant eyes on it. What's its purpose? It controls cat operations on the entire planet. There's always ships Blow coming and going. I came Blow face to face with the prefect there. Meanest, motherless Bissan I ever saw. Even the cat seemed afraid. We don't have much intel on her, though. Bassan, is that a new swear word? Do you know of any remnant sites? Or I guess. Ruins? Uh, I think so. Actually, don't. I don't know. Seek, do you ever read the dailies? No. You'll tell me if I need to know something. So where is it? Tall lights. Over on your right somewhere. I'll let you get back to your work. Yeah, you behave. We're watching you. Tempest, we're gonna need the Nomad. My position. Deploying forward station. Good luck, Ryder. 
Alright, I am gonna ask where the hell they're putting that. Over there. Oh, don't tell me it falls up into that. Mining zones in this region are available, Pathfinder. I've added them to your nav system. Oh no, the, the, it'll be dropped off over here. I can just holler. Okay, Sam, what's Vold got for us? Cat activity appears to be centered around this large <coughs> central command post. Blood up! According to resistance intelligence, the base coordinates all cat military efforts on Vold. Blood up! And taking it down will cripple their operations. In theory. However, given the trouble the Angara resistance has had infiltrating the base, it will not be a simple task. Who cares? I recommend a more cautious approach that starts with the investigation of smaller cat installations. Fine. Any suggestions on how to get on Ephra's good side? Resistance dispatches indicate there is someone in Hojara who needs help. We could visit Tekix, a larger and more established Angara dar that is nearby. Sounds good. Thanks, Sam. Pathfinder, Vault's temperature range is fixed well below freezing, with pockets of even more severe conditions. This necessitates the use of the Nomad. I advise against prolonged exposure to the cold. <laughs> Got it. Don't crash the <laughs> yeah. car. Our scans have Definitely. detected remnant monoliths, which suggests the what presence of a vault. And that means what we might people? be able to melt this ice cube. Oh, wow. <laughs> All right. We've got are you a dying? Out for us. Let's get going. What are people talking about with these side quests? Those made sense. Do stuff to make it easier to bug into the thing. Good. I, honestly, I don't know. I don't know what, what I haven't seen problems. anything other than the supplier. But I mean, that was a little one. Who cares? That's and literally on the way to everything. I like this about this. Uh, there's ice affects traction. Oh, that's pretty neat. Yeah. Oh, we're, oh I'm so gonna get in trouble playing this game when I get a turn. I'm already gonna get in trouble when I destroy uh, Breath of the Wild. <laughs> What's funny? Just remembering a joke I know. You won't get it. Try. I want to learn. Knock, knock. Who's there? Incompetently. An Elcor. Ha <laughs> 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 That was actually Whoa! Really funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I, I hadn't heard that one yet. Oh, Holy crap! Oh my! Where am I going? Beautiful. <laughs> Labor camp. Free the people. Oh, Viva god. la resistance! Uh, we're going here. Wherever here is, we're going there. My word, that was actually really funny. Incompetently, an Elcor. <laughs> <laughs> I love the Elcor, but they deserve that one. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, oh god, it teleported. Let's not have that, fool. Oh, so they brought the overheated thing by using the fire round. So now you have both aspects of that nonsense on you. Oh, I thought that's a rock. I thought there was another one behind him. Ooh, I like Jaws' gun. It's a cat weapon. I don't care. I like the cat weapon then. Oh, they duck. How neat is that? I can't get over that joke. <laughs> yeah, that joke was actually very funny. Oh, wow. Can we talk about what your people call the genophage? You 
want me to just casually talk about one of the most painful things about being Krogan? Yes. My clan's stronger than most, and this trip... Time. Let's just say we're working on it. Get machinery, Ryder. We should be careful. Thank Blow you. him up. What? Blow him up. Violence. Violence. All of it. Most of it. All surplus violence on sale. Here they come. Buy none, get all free. Oh, you missed. A little bit of a long shot for such a dump for such a big thing. Wow, genius. <laughs> Uh-oh. Something funny going on. Ooh, oh, God! Oh, I'm crap. gonna die. Because uh, I out. freaked out. Also, the game went ham. That was weird. Did you notice that? Yeah. Resume. Um, oh. Resume. I, I pressed a console command. How do I get out of this? Tildy. Okay. <laughs> well, I love how that's the, like, console button is tildy. Below normal temperatures. Okay. <laughs> Maybe we'll hear the joke again. You don't have the waypoint. I know where I'm going. You do? Yeah. I don't think you do. I feel like going here. Their little cars are strange. Yeah. Looks like a cross between a Jawa and something, a Jawa droid thing and something else. Hello. I'm not used to this now. It's either too sensitive or not sensitive enough for me. There you go, Drek. Getting shot at. Whoa, big boy. He's anointed. My normal button configuration's all screwed up. We're gonna have to go get your wheelie mouse so you can play. Just about. Well, this is our time up anyway, so ladies and gentlemen, I am Shopper to the Destroyer with Princess. Stay salty. I'll have to go get his wheelie mouse.